Let's see how it sounds. Hey, how the devil are you? Right, so, in my last video, I wanted to see whether two Echo fourth gens would sound better than one, e one Echo Studio. And in my personal opinion, even though the Echo fourth gens had a good stereo separation, I still felt that one Echo Studio just had a fuller sound, it had a punchier bass. It was just all in, I thought it was better overall. And it's not surprising really because you've got um, two three inch woofers against a 5.2 inch woofer. But what if you added <laughs> a six inch woofer to the fourth gens? Then it can't win, can it? So what I'm gonna do today is pit two fourth gens with a subwoofer against two Echo Studios. Will it be better? Let's have a look. Okay, I've got the sub set up and plugged in. All I need to do now is connect all the speakers to my cinema system. So we go to devices, hit the plus button, combine speakers, home cinema, and there you see I'll click the Echo Sub and the two Echo Fourth Gens, click next, and next again. They're gonna ask me to name it, home cinema, and next, kitchen, and save, and we're all sorted. Okay, so let's see how it sounds. Let's just skip on that nonsense, don't want to hear any of that. And go to that song I was playing before. Okay, let's have a listen to this. Okay, wow, that was really good. Uh, really good bass on that. Uh, very surprised actually. Um, let's put in just the Echo Studios now and see how they compare. And what I'll do, I'll do them a side-by-side -side comparison. I don't think the even two Echo Studios can compare to that. I don't think so. We'll have a go now. Right, so now what I've got is just the two Echo Studios set up together and nothing else. So let's do a side-by-side -side comparison of these compared to the other setup. What do you think? It's close, it's close, isn't it? I do think that, I know, oh, I would say the two Echo Fourth Gens with the sub does sound be better than two Echo Studios for me. The bass was just more punchy because you've got that big six inch woofer. So it is going to sound a little bit more bassy, a bit more oomph. Um, obviously you won't get that Dolby Atmos sound, but then again, you know, playing music, it was pretty good. So now, just for the hell of it, I'm going to connect the sub up to these two big lumps here just to see what it sounds like and then maybe do a side-by-side -side comparison of all three. Okay, so I've got it set up now with the two Echo Studios and the sub is down here all connected. Let's see how it sounds. The bass is almost too much. It's really basic. Let's whack the volume up a little bit more. Alexa, volume nine. My neighbors are gonna kill me. Okay, let's do a side-by-side -side comparison of all three setups.
what's the take home from this? Well, in my opinion, and it is only my opinion, if you disagree with me, please let me know in the comment section below. Let me know, I'd like to know what you think. I would say that two Echo fourth gens uh, with an Echo Sub does sound better than two Echo Studios. That's my opinion. Um, it is gonna cost you an extra 20 quid more for that setup, so it's about 380 pounds for two Echo fourth gens with a Sub at full price, and two Echo Studios at full price are gonna come in around about 360. Um, when you're looking at two Echo Studios and the subwoofer, yes, it sounds really good. I'm probably gonna have a few noise complaints. Please knock on my door in the next 10 minutes. But Listen to us. Hello. We've got a call, haven't we? Because we've got to come, otherwise, right. there might be something going on here. So. There we go. Um, yeah, so that is a good setup, but obviously you're gonna pay, on top of that, another 120 quid. That about wraps up the video for today. Thanks for watching. If you did like the video, give the video a thumbs up. Uh, it does help the, the traction of the video. Uh, tells uh, YouTube algorithms, go on, push it along. So I really appreciate that. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And also, if you want to join me in a beer, we can't meet up and have a beer in a pub. So why not go down to my description box below, Living Well TV link, and buy me a beer. Cheers.